Hi everybody, this is Deanna Bailey with the Texas Blockchain Council and I'm here with fellow council member Mark Cole and we just wanted to talk to you a little bit about the Blockchain Summit. So hi Mark, thank hey, you for being it's here. It's really good to be here. It's been an incredible event so far. It's so informative, it's so exciting to be around people that are so enthusiastic and well informed. It's really, really an amazing day. What do you think your favorite part so far is? Gosh, that is, that is really good. I mean, I, on the Lightning Network um, discussion, I felt like I really learned a lot. So I'm, I'm always eager to learn and, and try to apply and think. Um, you know, Cruz, Senator Cruz is obviously awesome and it's to see him so well informed and so um, encouraging to us, but also realistic that we do have some challenges ahead of yeah. us. That was, that was an important point. As yeah, well, so. I agree. I, w I would say that the level of government participation is probably one of the higher uh, higher here than I've seen at some other events. Yeah, I think that's right. Yeah, and it's very encouraging for Texas, right? And that's part of, you know, to, in Texas we have to do economic development, we have to marshal our energy resources, but we do have to create a public policy, legal environment that is crypto friendly. And I think the universal um, making that our goal is, is also very encouraging. Everyone is completely on the same page. We're going to do it in Texas. Yeah. We're going to create the legal environment. It's going to happen and that's extremely important. Yeah, I agree. And, and I would say, having been here and interviewed a few different people, the type of companies that are here are revolutionary as well. I mean, I think I've gone everything from mining to yep. different waste management, how we can utilize different powers to companies that are leveraging blockchain for Fortune 500 companies. I mean, it's just profound, right? There is no loss of lack of, um, there's no, no lack of intelligence and innovative energy entrepreneurial drive, it's, it's really incredible. Yeah, so you and I co-host right. uh, the Woodlands Meetup with a, fe a fellow chamber member. Right. Um, and so what was your personal reason for getting into this? Like what drew you to blockchain? And to blockchain, well, first of all, interest in the technology and that really preceded my interest in the investment. And, and then I started looking at the investment returns about really about a year ago. And you, at, at some point you have to say, look, you cannot, you cannot ignore this space anymore. And then of course, as you start to study and learn, and then you go down the rabbit hole of the technology and just all the use cases and the applications of it, then it becomes really kind of just extremely interesting. And then you start meeting people and everyone is, is, is awesome. And yeah. so, and then you realize, you know, this is really important to the cause of freedom and for really for humanity. And so it's, for me, it was sort of innovation, technology, investment, but then also really um, a movement, for sure. And, and then, of course, I want everything good for Texas. And when you of realize course. Texas <laughs> is uniquely positioned to capitalize on crypto and blockchain, well then, you know, I'm sold and I'm, I'm gonna, <laughs> yeah, right? I'm here and I'm, and I'm staying and I'm not moving. I mean, this is, this is important. Yeah, I agree. I feel like the rest of the U.S. is still trying to recover from the, the recent events of the past two years. And trying to get their footing, whereas Texas is just grabbing a hold of you know the latest and, and greatest, and really trying to spearhead our economy forward. Absolutely, didn't you love all the non-native Texans? You know, talking today about how they've moved here and how the culture is just different. I mean, they they are uniformly praising Texas and its its spirit and its ethos, and that's just you know for those of us who've lived here a long time, we. We don't really take it for granted, but it's good to hear it from people that have only recently moved here, that it, yeah. it really is true. It's a special, special place. Are you born and raised Texas? Well, I got here when I was seven years old. So, you know, mostly mostly raised here, but born in Oklahoma. Okay, see, I'm one of the newbies. I've right? been here about a year. Um, and but have been a veteran, like I've, I've done a lot of schools in Texas anyways, because that's where all the Army Medical School right. is, right down at Fort Sam Houston or Joint Base Sam Houston. Um, so I've, I've been to Texas, but to be here and to be a veteran and to be in blockchain and just be so welcomed and received well, like everybody is friendly, everybody is accommodating. I just feel like I'm with my people. Yeah, and that, that's so good to hear. And I often say, you know, Texans are all around the world and some of the people that are Texans don't even yet know it. And they, they will get here eventually when they need to. And they're always welcome. Yeah, they I are. agree. Yeah, I agree. Well, so we're both part of the, the Texas Blockchain Council. Why do you think this council is even important? Like, why why be a member of it? I mean, we have to we have to educate the public, and we have to get you know the 
the resources necessary to create the right legal environment. We also have to help um, the economic development and, and so much of what we've already done in the council is just meeting other people with an interest in this space. I mean, I have several business conversations going on just as a result of who we've met in the council. And, and then just, just the networking and um, being encouraged and bouncing ideas off of each other and feeding off of the enthusiasm. I mean, it's just, it's just so important and this is how this is how Texas will become the crypto blockchain yeah. capital of the world. Yeah. It's the work of this of the Texas Blockchain Council. Yeah, I agree completely. So, is there anything you want to say to our viewers as we? No, no just uh, jump in, keep learning, keep That's investing, right. helping other people, um, having other people help you. All you know, advance your knowledge every day. Um, work hard and 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 keep freedom as your. You know, your, one of your core values. That's all I would say. How about you? Yeah, well, for anybody who's interested and doesn't know that much about blockchain, we host meetups yes. in all the major cities. So Houston, Dallas, Austin. And it's not hard to do. And so any any city that is, you know, watching, and if you don't have a meetup, um, or even if it's a large city, you know, your city can accommodate. If you, you know, start a meetup, because there are people out there that want to meet other crypto people, yeah. or they're crypto curious, right. or they're veterans, and they everyone needs to be coming together and, you know, having conversations and encouraging each other. So start start your own meetup. That's what I would say. That's right. <laughs> Get the word out. Get the word out. All right. Awesome. Well, thank you, thank Mark, you. for taking yeah, the time. Awesome. I appreciate really good. it. Thank you. Thank you.